Hi, my name is Park Pepper and I'm the Executive Director of the Bedour Center in Senatobia, Mississippi. Welcome. The mission of Bedour Center is to be a model residential community for adults with intellectual disabilities in, in an environment that promotes maximum growth intellectually, spiritually, physically, socially, emotionally, and vocationally. Uh, we serve persons from all across the United States here in Senatobia, Mississippi, representing probably 25 of the 50 states, uh, helping individuals reach their God-given potential. Bedour Center, in an effort to help residents live, learn, work, worship, and play is broken into several program areas, most notably residential services, uh, encompasses all types of family life, home living, teaches residents how to live more independently. We also have vocational services through which residents uh, work, where they learn skills, where they build esteem, where they earn a paycheck, and are able to, uh, to be you know, active members of society. Uh, we also have the Community Life Division. They are the self-proclaimed fun division. Here you find spiritual growth, you find fitness, recreation, you find the expressive and performing arts. And you know, the goal is to provide all of these programs and services so that residents live and, and enjoy very well-rounded lives. The Bedour Center celebrated its 41st birthday in 2019, opening its doors uh, first on December the 8th, 1978. Uh, the Bedour family, uh, who had founded the Fred's chain stores, uh, had uh, partnered at the time with the Mississippi Conference and actually the Southeastern Conference of the United Methodist Church, develop and design a place that would uh, best serve, optimally serve, uh, persons with intellectual disabilities. The conference in that 41 years has continued to partner with Bedour Center in countless ways. Uh, uh, probably most notably and recognizably, uh, our choir, The Miracles, uh, has performed, uh, I imagine, in most uh, United Methodist churches throughout the state in, 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 in spanning four decades. The conference has, uh, has, has partnered with us in countless other ways, sending volunteer groups, uh, sending tours, referring uh, persons to live here. Uh, it's been a, a long uh, partnership and one that we're, for which we're very thankful. Uh, a lot of people uh, want to know how they can get involved. Uh, most directly, I can say we, uh, we, we welcome financial support. Uh, the residents and their families uh, pay tuition, which accounts for probably between 50 and 60 percent of the annual cost of the Door Center. We are responsible through other uh, entrepreneurial efforts, fundraising, uh, to, to, to make up that 40 percent. Uh, I think one of the neatest ways to be involved at the Door Center is through volunteerism or to participate in our uh, several special events throughout the year. You can find those on our website, which is www. Uh, .badour, B -A -D -D -O -U -R .O -R -G org, um, or you can again come out here. I, I think one of the neatest things about Badour Center is when you have the opportunity to come here, the experience of, of meeting residents, of walking around our beautiful campus. I often tell folks you cannot leave Badour Center without feeling a little happier than when you arrived. Simply put, we want you to visit us we want you to see what we see every day, which is an environment where residents don't simply live, but where they uh, are supported to thrive, where they are, where they are afforded, uh, provided, supported with opportunities to be all that God created them to be.